And this review covers both the process of collimating a Newtonian telescope and gives a review of the Tektron tools. Uh, we'd like to, I'd like to read one section in here from the book, Perspectives on Collimation, where they talk about offsetting the secondary. And I quote, In most cases, the resulting secondary mirror diameter is sufficiently oversized to accommodate the small amount of offset required. Since offset only affects the illumination of the periphery of one side of the field, and then only in a few percent illumination, we will assume that for Newtonian configurations of f4.5 and higher, that accommodation for offset is not absolutely required. That kind of sums up our view on offset. We could have spent a lot of time going into the detailed calculations on how to offset your secondary. And if you're interested in that, there's another source that covers that. This is called Star Testing Astronomical Telescopes by Dick Souter. This book will give you all you need to know about offsetting your diagonal. It'll give you the equations and will also put in perspective uh, how important it'll be to your performance. Well, you're probably wondering, what's behind door number three? <laughs>